heard him on the Tom Joyner Morning Show. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for the one and only Jay Anthony Brown. What's up? What the fuck is going on? How y'all doing? How the fuck y'all doing? Pump it up, pump it up, pump it up! Is it Atlanta in the house? All right, cut it off. Where the fuck these people at? What? This don't make no goddamn sense. Where the fuck they at? We need to take their seats. We need to get up and move them motherfuckers. Just had this whole middle section just empty as fuck. What's up, white people? How y'all doing? Y'all so goddamn glad the sniper was black, y'all almost peed on your motherfucker southern. You motherfuckers. Oh, you got white people speaking to your ass, ain't never said shit to you. Ain't never opened their fucking mouth. I heard they called the sniper, how about that? Did you hear they called the sniper? Hey, they called the sniper. Motherfuckers won't even talk to you, but not hey. Hey, nigga, they called the sniper. God damn it. And y'all was not having a good year either. Oh man, the sharks was fucking y'all up. Goddamn was kicking your ass in tennis, golf, but goddamn it had to be two black snipers. Fuck the fucking, fuck I hate that shit. You knew they was black when the motherfuckers asked for 10 million dollars. What the fuck is this? White people just kill your ass, don't ask for shit. Oh, and $10 million in an account that ain't open. What the fuck? Stay in school! Stay in school! Stay your bitch ass in school! I gotta watch where I'm going. Don't want to fall off the stage like Kirk Franklin did. That motherfucker fell smooth the fuck off stage, huh? Folks say don't laugh because he Christian shit. <laughs> Christians fall. <laughs> Hell, they wrote a song about it. We fall down, but we get up. How the fuck he fall off the stage? The goddamn whiners ain't never fell off the goddamn stage. There'd be a hundred whiners on stage at one goddamn time. We ain't never lost a fucking whiner. The five blind boys ain't never fell off the fucking stage. I'm so glad to be here anytime I can be away from Tom Jones' ass. I don't know what the fuck to do. Yeah, fella, sometimes you want to just gut punch the shit out your balls. Yeah, fella, I would just slap it in his motherfucking mouth. Ooh. No, every goddamn thing. I tried to tell him, don't take your fucking clothes off and get naked in the Ebony magazine. Did y'all see that shit? Did y'all? What the fuck? That motherfucker looked like a wet ass ham. Did y'all see that? I don't like none of them. I can't stand none of them. Goddamn, Mary J. Tips for the. Oh, I can't stand none of them. The fuck she giving y'all tips? That boy, 57 years old. How the fuck she giving y'all tips? I was so glad when they fired Tabby Smiley's ass. I didn't know what the fuck to do. And Miss Dupree, she got the gift. She got to use it. Ain't that some shit? Fucking gift she got. September 11th. We didn't hear from that bitch, huh? I don't y'all tell him I said this, all right? I'm just sharing some shit. But what's up? What's up, old plaid pimp? The old plaid pimp sitting up front. Get a picture of the old plaid pimp. Look at him. Pull back, pull back. Get to all that. That's what look like a runaway picnic. What the fuck? Like you ought to set a big picture of Kool-Aid on his ass. <laughs> All right, all right, player. <laughs> One of them old ass players. Eh? Yeah, way back. Look at this. See what I'm talking about? Look at this shit and look at the fucking, fucking, fuck. All right, Christian, Christian, where the Christians at? Christian, raise your hand. I'm sorry, I apologize. Christians, pump it up. Christians, 
Christians who drink, where they at? Where they at? It's always more drinking Christians, ain't it? That's right. Jesus made wine. That's right. He sure did. He made wine. I'm trying to stop cussing. I really am. I'm, I'm working on it. I talked to my pastor about it. He said, fuck it. They laughing. That's what he said. So, Speaking of Christians, what are Catholics at? Catholics, you, ooh, you motherfuckers, you, God. Woo, y'all need to kill the, what? Have y'all seen the Pope? What the, is it, what? Have you seen the Pope? What the fuck is wrong with the Pope? Have you seen him? Is it just, the Pope came sit up. Have you seen him? It's that big ass hat. That hat's too fucking big. I don't give an old man a hat like that. I'm going need a tango or a cap or something like that. He leaning on, yeah, yeah, yeah. He had a Baptist minister with a hat that big, couldn't sit up. They fold him out and talk to these priests. Somebody tell the Pope to talk to these fucking nasty ass, fucking, fuck, ooh, fucking these little boys, you fucking, ooh, the fuckers. Pope can't even deal with them. Need to talk to him with that Pope talk. You know how the Pope talk to him. Oh, you nasty motherfucker. Stop fucking little boys in there. Oh, 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 hey. You motherfuckers gonna ride in hell. Oh, 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 oh. E, e, oh, e. Security. That's funny. That's funny, security. You can laugh. You can laugh. They told you not to laugh. Fucking mall security man. That's what the fuck. Mall security man. He's a mall security man. He's watching the mall wherever he can. He's a mall security man. Everybody he. Everybody he. Hey, hey, he's watching the mall wherever he can. He's a mall security. All right, hum it, hum it, hum it. You're going to be singing that motherfucker when you leave here. Huh? Motherfucker going to be in your head. You're in mall security, man. He's a mall again. He's watching the mall wherever he can. All right. Are y'all ready to get this motherfucker started? Lena, are you ready? It's Camelton Road in the house. All right. Put your hands together. When I say bruise, you say, what the fuck is wrong with y'all? When I say bruise, you say bruise, bruise. Well, hey, 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 hey. All right, don't make me set fire to this motherfucker. Though. When I say bruise, you say bruise, 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 bruise. From Atlanta, y'all, put your hands together. Make you feel welcome. Give it up for bruise. What's up, y'all? What's up? Cut the music off. Cut the music off. Didn't need people get a seat. What, what happened, man? I gave these seats away, man. Oh, my God. It's hot in here. Oh, I see my kin folks in here. What's happening? What's happening, man? Because I look good in a pink suit. You and that dude sitting mighty close. I don't know what's going on. It ain't that kind of party. Hello. See, that, that turned you on, didn't it? Okay. No, security be on got you up in a minute. You got the move, player. <laughs> yeah, sure it is. Sure. 
What's up, y'all? Got a lot of pimps in the audience. What's going on? Hey, girl, that's my baby mama out there. Look, you didn't have to come up here for that little money. You understand what I'm saying? I would have mailed you the little money. You called cussing my mama out. That ain't right. You know my mama a Christian woman. You know that. Brother behind you got on a sweater, though. I don't know where he got it, but he got it on. Bless his heart. I don't know what's going on. I mean, he got more colors. No, you got him beat, player. Good God Almighty. Your boy got on some bullshit right here, right here. He got coochie right here, right here. Bam! I don't know what's that on the outside. You understand what I'm saying? Bless his heart. But it looks good on you. Don't get mad. Ain't nothing you can do about it. He trying not to laugh. Fat motherfucker. Uh, fat ass mother. Boy, if he wasn't on that stage. Now, nah, hey, I'm sorry I even messed with your sweater, okay? Please forgive me. Cause Do you see this one? Right here. He look like a box of crayon. Do you hear me? Bless his heart. That's what old people say about you. Something wrong with you. Bless your heart, ain't it? You ever be in church, somebody got an ugly baby? Your grandma walked from nowhere. Is that your baby? Bless his heart. That mean that baby is fucked up. Because everybody child in that cute. Somebody got some little gorillas at the house. Am I lying? You ever have somebody show you a picture like, damn, this your baby for real? Boy, he looks just like his daddy. People don't even want to hold an ugly baby. Hold my baby, girl. You know my arm oh, fucked up. Little baby walk behind. You better pick me up. You better call the ugly ass baby. And now that I think about it, I'm tired of old people. I'm tired of old people saying what they want to say to us and hurting our feelings and walking off. And you know, you taught as a child when an old person says something to you, you don't talk back. Am I right? But now I am an adult. I let they ass have it. You hear me? I'm in church Sunday. I spoke to this old lady. I said, hey, ma'am, how you doing? She said, hey, baby, how big you going to get? I say, bitch, how old you going to get? She got mad. You fat motherfucker, you old bitch. We in church now. You know what I'm saying? Take me home, old fat ass boy. Is it me or is it hot in here? Shit. What y'all got to air on hell? I'm sweating like a pimp with one hoe, yeah, man? You ever seen a pimp with one hoe? He about to work at a death. She get mad. You got to have some more bitches. This is ridiculous. Like, bitch, you better tighten up. Oh, my God. Hey, man, I got a cousin a little bit bigger than me, right? For real. Yeah, he a big motherfucker, for real. He bought a 1999 Ford Escort. He came to my house, let's go get something to eat. I said, shit, where am I sit? He said, I get in the front, you get in the back. I said, God damn it, let's ride. We go down the street, call it like it's full of niggas. Everybody, man, look at all them niggas in that car. Police pulled us over, all six of y'all get out. Oh, I'm sorry, I thought it was six people y'all drive on. You ever see somebody so big when they eating, they be humming, you know what I'm talking about? We was at all you can eat restaurant, that nigga like, hmm, 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 hmm. <laughs> then he gave out a breath. <laughs> I said, you all right? Yeah, I'm straight. He'll start dancing before we eat. You know what I'm talking about? We, I said, man, we get ready to go. So he'd he be like, mm, 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 Have you ever went to an all-you-can-eat restaurant and sat at the buffet? I ain't say sit around. I mean sat at that motherfucker. You ever did that? We did that. The man said, y'all can't sit here. Y'all, he said, what the hell? He got on some of your suit, nigga. He got the other part of your goddamn suit. He got the jacket and the pants. This nigga here just got the front of it. You hear me right here? Put it light on this nigga. Bam! I'm oh, just kidding. Don't get mad. Ain't nothing you can do about it. Boy, the pimps are arriving in this motherfucker this evening. Woo-wee! Look at them pimps right there. Hey, you ever notice though, stuff about people that people don't know they're doing? Like I got a partner, he always shake his head when he talk to you. You ever seen a nigga like that? This nigga named Jimmy. I be like, what's up, Jimmy? Shit, what's happening, baby? I be like, what's wrong with your head? Shit, ain't nothing wrong with my head. He do this shit so much, I start doing it. I said, so what? What's going on? He said, what's wrong with your head? I said, ain't shit wrong with my head. We were riding down the street. Nigga thought we were listening to some music. Me and that nigga in that motherfucker. I'm still a motherfucker. I don't care. 
Like, you don't supposed to mess with a person that has a dysfunction in their life. Am I right? Your parents teach you not to mess with nobody, right? We're going to a drugstore today. I didn't know the manager had a stuttering problem. They want no stutter like Get it out. You know what I'm talking about? We walked in. I said, hey, how you doing? He said, oh. I thought he was fucking with me. Like, this motherfucker crazy, you know what I'm saying? I got back to the register. He said, all right. I said, you just finished that motherfucker? I've been in here for 10 minutes. I got a cousin. He could never say Bruce. He'd be like, bro, 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 bro. I'm like, nigga, write me a note. He wrote a note like that. Bro, 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 bro. Tell me in Braille. And everybody, they get mad with us because we fat. Quit calling us fat motherfuckers, okay? We already know we fat. You understand what I'm saying? Y'all kill me, you fat motherfucker? That don't bother me. The lady called me that the other day. You fat motherfucker? I just looked at her. That don't make me mad. Bitch, you want to make me mad? You tell me Popeye chicken going out of business. Goddamn, I set this theater on fire. And boy, Christmas cream donut to make you wreck your damn car. Am I lying? You could be riding that damn hot light. Come on. Like, give me six. Give me six of them glaze. Give me six. Six of them glaze, goddamn. She'll say, you could get six more for a dollar. You'll be like, quit bullshit. <laughs> Go on, put them in there. Put them in there. Goddamn, put them in there. Nigga, I can eat a dozen before I get home. You think I'm bullshitting? My teeth don't even touch them, motherfucker. I'll be like, ah! <laughs> my little girl like, Daddy, you ain't even eating them. I say, God damn, you ain't supposed to. Ooh, wee! I'm talking about this shit is coming out this evening. How you looking, baby? How you doing? Do y'all see this shit she got on? Bless her heart. But it looks good on you. You look good, baby. Don't let me bother you. What is that? What is that mixed with? God damn. That, that's, ooh, shit. That jacket mis mixed with something. I don't know what it is. Might be Pitbull or Rockwall. I don't, I don't know, but I, I see it somewhere. I'm just kidding. You're looking good, baby. Looking very jazzy this evening. Oh, my God, I'm stupid. Anybody have any children? Beat your children. Go home, wake them up, beat them. They have done something you don't know about. You do not have to reason with a child. You are the parent, and what you say goes. White people, quit making deals with your kids. You understand what I'm saying? You do not have to make a deal with a child. My mom used to make a deal. She said, buddy, cut the front yard. When you get through, don't forget the back. And that's the motherfucking deal. Y'all got to get back to start threatening your kids before you go anywhere. My mom used to threaten me before we go anywhere. She used to tell me, she said, Bruce, we going to Kmart and don't ask me for shit. <laughs> Nigga, I got in Kmart one time. I saw a fire truck I wanted so bad. I wanted that motherfucker. You know how you be looking? I want that fire truck right there. I want that goddamn fire truck. I want that fire truck. Goddamn fire truck. My daddy came around the corner. You see something you want? He like, what is it? He said, that fat truck? I said, yeah, but mama told me no ass up for shit. My daddy said, well, damn, you trying to get us both fucked up. <laughs> Beat your children. And one thing about kids, kids got questions and parents, you got to have an answer. And do not tell your kids anything to get them out your face because kids don't forget nothing. So make sure you tell them the truth the first time because they're going to hit you with the same question down the line to see if they're going to get the same answer. You understand what I'm saying? Because I'm telling you, don't be like my uncle. My uncle used to tell me anything just to get me out of his face. You know what I'm talking about? Let me tell you this. I was with my uncle one time. I was seven years old. He was sitting, we were sitting in the car waiting on my aunt to come out of the grocery store. I saw a person I had never seen before in my life. My uncle reading the newspaper. I told my uncle, I said, hey. He said, what? I said, I just seen a little bitty boy man. He said, what? I said, I just seen a little bitty boy man. He said, what the fuck is a little bitty boy man? I said, there he is, he coming out the store right now. My uncle said, man, that's a midget. I said, where they come from? This man said, shout dicks. So watch what you tell your children. 
And on the same token, you got to get an understanding with which kids, so when it's time of trouble, they'll come to you. You understand what I'm saying? I'm going to tell you, my kids and I are real, real cool. Let me tell you, my 14 year old son asked me the other day, because we cool. He said, Hey, Dad, can I ask you something? I said, Yeah, man, what's up? He said, Man, it's been on my mind. I said, What is it? He said, Man, don't you hate when you sit down and use the bathroom and your thing fall in the water? I said, wait a minute, hold on, hold on, hold on. I said, are you standing here telling me your dick in the water? <sighs> Nigga, my dick ain't even touching the toilet seat. I looked him straight in the eye, I said, boy, I know what you're talking about. Son, dick bigger than mine, that can't be my real son, couldn't it, man? I know, because they don't make dicks like that no more. My granddad had a dick this long, you know what I mean? You know how old men had to take a bath, and you had to give him a bath, y'all remember that? My granddad took off his clothes, we thought we were retarded. But granddad, what the hell wrong with you? We had to put a dick in the tub first. <laughs> he said in the tub, yeah, boy, he's a knock him down with this motherfucker. I'm like, damn, granddad, you die, can I have that mother? I don't want no money on that. Let me get that dick off your player. So beat your children. And fellas, fellas, foreplay is very, very important in a relationship. And a lot of you all got foreplay mixed up. A lot of you all think foreplay is feeling on your girl, licking on her, then making love to a gentleman. This is not foreplay. Foreplay is mental. It's done 24 hours a day dealing with your woman on a daily day basis. And if you do this foreplay like I tell you to do it, I mean, you do make love to her, it won't take her very long to come because mentally, she's already there. Foreplay can mean numerous of things. Foreplay keeps peace in the home. You understand what I'm saying? One thing I learned about a woman, if a woman loves you, she will do anything. But you got to get her to that point. Foreplay, this is a sign of foreplay. Your woman take a shower and walk past you naked, tap that ass. She ain't going to do nothing but back up, but you better stop. If your woman in the kitchen cooking, walk up behind her like you're somebody else. She'll be like, hey, baby, you got a man? She'll be like, shit, you don't know him, you don't know him. Like I told my cousin, I said, boy, you're going to lose your woman. You don't do nothing but go to work, come home, go to work, come home. You need to spend some time with that woman to do something with her. He said, what you think I ought to do? I said, shh, anything. He said, what I ought to do? I said, wrestle. Women love to wrestle. He said, shit, I'm going to wrestle with her when I get home. I happened to stop by his house. He got his girl broke down. Bitch, give up. I break your goddamn neck. Give up. I'm like, hold on, man. Damn, hold on. You're supposed to let her win. He said, my shit, you ain't tell me all that. I put her ass on a back player. Who is all these people just drifting in this motherfucker? I know everybody in here too. I know that. What's up, first cousin? It's alright, baby. You see this nigga suit right here? Right here. That one ain't bad. Wait till you see the one behind you, pimp. Just look over your right shoulder. Just look over there. Look. Just look. Look over your right shoulder. Right shoulder. Just look. Bam! Right there. He got on some bullshit. This nigga ought to be working in the mayor's office, shouldn't he? We talking about you, Pimp? How you doing, brother? He probably a model or something, be modeling underwear and shit all in Sears. Hey, you ever go to Walmart by 3 in the morning and don't be with like 12 people in the store and you be in the store and, don't, and you be on aisle 12 and somebody call on the microphone, security aisle 12. Then you go to aisle 13, security aisle 13. I need to get the fuck out of this motherfucker. This nigga is serious seeing these people. Look, right here. Why are you so serious? You just seeing people? Damn. Look at the dude right there with a the little jacket on. What's happening, P.L.? Looking like he's saying with Bobby Womack. What's happening? But listen. I'm going to tell you all this. There's something I learned about pornos. Anybody watch pornos? Anybody watch pornos? Do you know it's a difference between black and white pornos? Do you know white pornos, they all, you always know how they met and everything. Because white people always got this, well, all right. You ever notice that? How you doing? Great. Let's go have a party. Well, all right. 
You know, I looked at a white porno, the guy walked up to this girl, he's like, hey, Carol, what's going on? Hey, Chuck, how you feel? Doing great. Let's go to the beach. Well, all right. <laughs> then a little music come on. Black pornos ain't like that. Soon as you put the tape in, click, got that, click, 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 click. Nigga looking in the camera, what's happening? Play a click, 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 click. You go right back to the white one. What's up, photographer? In the tuxedo, what the fuck you going through? A photographer in a tuxedo. Thank you, player. And listen, y'all, I don't have an ending joke because I don't tell jokes. I tell real life stories and make them funny. So when I get to performing on stage, I don't have an ending joke. I don't be like, peace, I'm out of here. I don't do that. I just walk the fuck off. You know what I mean? So to everybody in the ATL, you know I'm from Bankhead. But right now, peace out. Some people want diamond in me. 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 Some people want. Alright, okay, alright. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck this shit. Give it up for Bruce, y'all. Oh my goodness, my goodness. Married people in the house. Where the married people at? Where the players at? Player, let me hear you say player, player. Punk ass motherfuckers, listen to that. No response. None. You down here with your evil ass woman, you can't say shit. I know what it is. She's sitting next to you going, yell it out, yell it out. I'll slap you right in your fucking throat. I will chop you in your motherfucking head. I'm going to get married again. Next time I get married, marry me a white woman. That's what I'm going to do. Hey, fuck y'all. Y'all don't know my pain. You don't know what the fuck I've been through. I done had my clothes cut the fuck up. I done had fuck you written on the side of my car. Evil ass. What happened to y'all ladies? You get mad, you just get fucking evil. Just fucking evil ass shit. Get mad that you ain't gonna cook a goddamn thing. Oh, you'll come home and smell chicken, but your ass won't find none. It's her fucking ass and ate it all up. Sitting in the living room sucking her goddamn teeth. We ate, motherfucker. Should have been here when we was eating. We got a little bit of rice. How the fuck you make one slice of cornbread, ladies? How in the fuck do you make one slice of cornbread? And you can forget pussy when they get mad at you. Forget it. Forget it. Get it out your mind. Oh, you'll see pussy. You'll see the pussy walk by. Oh, they love to get naked when they're mad at your ass. Walk all around the house butt-ass naked. In the kitchen frying fish, hot grease just popping on the ass. Ow! Ow! That's why we steal it. It's a delicate operation in the players. That's what they need to teach you in school. How to get sex from a woman late at night. How the fuck they don't feel you pulling on their damn drawers? They feel that. The fuck you don't feel that? <laughs> you got the kids helping you. Come on, boy! Help your daddy get your drawers off your mama! And players, before I go, don't let these women trick you in oral sex. I can't tell you how many times I've been tricked in oral sex. They trick you. They tell you, you do me, I'll do you. They ain't gonna do you. I don't give a fuck how long you stay down there. They won't do your ass. You can come up looking like a glazed donut. They won't do your ass. Soon as your turn comes, I'm sleepy, I'm sleepy. Mm, I'm tired. Mm -mm. Too late to be sucking dick now, uh-uh. It's at 12 o'clock. I don't suck no dick at 12 o'clock. That was yesterday I said I'd suck your dick. Mm -hmm. You should have said something. You saw me sitting over there. And don't beg nobody to suck your dick. She want to suck your dick. Go to sleep. Poking her in the back all fucking night long. You ain't doing nothing now. Nah. How about now? Nah? You ain't doing nothing now. Nah. How about now? Nah? How you like somebody poke you in your fucking back with a dick all night long? How about now? Nah? 
Keep on, you're going to make your woman mad. I had to learn this the hard way. You do not want an angry person to suck your dick. Oh, you think you do. You want to suck? Take it out. Take it the fuck out. I'm tired of you bothering me. I'm trying to fucking sleep. Take it out. Are you happy now? Is that what you want? You like this? Let it go. Let it go. I suck it myself. Are y'all ready to take this motherfucker to another level? When I say Ricky, you say, what the fuck? When I say Ricky, you say, when I say Ricky, you say, Ricky, Ricky, give it up for Ricky Smiley. That's my damn song right there. That's my damn song right there. Nigga, if I die tomorrow, y'all better play it at my funeral. I don't want no damn sad funeral. When they bring the casket in the church, I want the power bearer. Nigga, hit it again, hit it again. funerals off the hook them niggas dropped the casket <laughs> what's up y'all laugh is good and all the time hell yeah welcome to the section a portion of the show section a like if you get your girl pregnant she have to go down to the housing authority and fill out the application but you can't put your name on there because then the rent too high you know some people on section that rent one dollar a month and still get put out? You're like, damn, can't you pay a quarter a week? I'll be getting my rent out of the church collection basket. Forgive me, sweet Jesus. You know I got to pay my rent. Jesus is on the main line. <laughs> but y'all need to pray for my grandma, man. My grandma got old. She tripped. My grandma then called me yesterday. I said, I said, hello, hey baby, how you doing? I said, all right. I got some news for you. They done caught the snapper. I said they caught the snapper. Yeah, the snapper. They done got them damn snappers. <laughs> I ain't know what the hell the way on stage, man. I, I stopped on the side of the road and got me a little outfit down there by, by the underground. I bought me some fake Tommy Hill figures. I took that shit home and watched it. It said Necker Fecker. Trekker, Wrecker, Necker Fecker. Trekker, Wrecker, Necker Fecker. <laughs> Y'all up in here, man. I, you know, I be on my. Y'all remember back in the day when your grandmama get drunk, start crying, talking about she gonna die. Be scaring the hell out of you and your sister. Grandma tell me, you know I'm gonna be dead tomorrow. You be, I'm gonna be dead tomorrow. Don't die, grandma. Don't die, grandma. Yeah, y'all about to get on my damn nerve. They gonna roll me out of here in the morning. See, white people go to grandmother's house. White people, they go to grandmother's house. You know, white people go to grandmother's house. Over the mountain and through the woods to grandmother's house we go. We don't go to grandmother's house. We get dropped off over there. Remember back in there when your mama dropped you off over your grandma's house and forget about you? Coming out with that cigarette hanging at the end of her, your mama need to come get y'all with her trifling ass. 
that left y'all over here all weekend. She ain't called to check to see if you had no clean clothes set. Hey, cat, dog, or nothing. But put my nightgown on and get your ass in the bed. Get in the bed, your grandma bed about that high. The blanket's about that thick, the cover's so heavy, you can't even turn over. You in the bed just stuck. I wanna go home. Lay your goddamn ass down. Then you go to your great grandma house. What's the first thing your great grandma asks you when you walk up in there? Baby, you want a banana? You look up on the refrigerator, them damn bananas been up there about eight months. They all brown and stuff. When you peel it, it be banana pudding. You just cry. I don't want it. You shouldn't have asked for it. Eat it. Eat that goddamn banana. Eat that goddamn banana. Cause all my grandma do is go to funeral homes and view bodies, she don't even know the people. My grandma, if she know the person that know the person that know the person, she going to that funeral and would get up to the casket and act a plum fool. Y'all ain't never went to view the body with your grandma? You know how your grandma be going up in there? You know how your grandma, she be. You know. Hashima Baba C. How was Sama Bin Laden? Y'all niggas going to hell with gasoline drove. Huh? Come on up, Prince. Where you at? Come on. We're going to do some music with man. My grandma, man, we be up in church. How many of y'all had an old lady at y'all church to be leading devotion? Be singing one of them hymns with absolutely no ending. Y'all know, clap round applause, you know what I'm talking about. Old lady be leading devotion. Singing them hymns with absolutely no ending at all. You know how they be. One more time, one more time. Lord, I'm glad to be in the service. One more time. If my mother was here to How many of y'all had a lady that sang at y'all church? When she be singing, she be looking straight up into heaven. Look like she looking straight at Jesus. You know, she be, she be. He touched me. Everybody in church be like this. The hell is See, I joined, I joined the white church because white people, they get out on time. White people go to church at 11 o'clock, 11.40, they out of there. You got time to get home, watch the game. We go at 11, don't start at 11.40, get out at 5 o'clock Thursday. You done lost your job fooling with Bishop. And that's how I learned the words to Amazing Grace at a white church. When white people saying Amazing Grace is different. White people, you know, you know, white people, they be amazing grace, how sweet, hallelujah, the song that said a rich like me, oh The black version ain't nothing like that in it. You got the sister come out of the kitchen, the one with the big titty with the little bitty legs with the calf muscles. You know how she come out. You know it's different when she come out. You know she.
y'all know I ain't lying, boy. <laughs> y'all going to hell. How come the choirs don't march in no more? What happened? How come the choir? Y'all know I hate. Y'all remember when the choir used to march in? I used to have it going on, didn't it? But y'all know who I used to hate marching in? That dog on the mail, them old men on men's day. They be off beat. <laughs> You know, how them, you know how them old men, they be, and they, they be mad, they be looking at the musician like he wrong, like he off beat. You know, they be mean as hell, you know how them old men, they be. One of my nuts popped out. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, this would be killing me. Now, you know you done went to choir rehearsal. Y'all done been to choir rehearsal. You done practice on your song, too. So you know darn well you got a solo Sunday. Why we look like we so surprised when the musician play our song? Am I lying? We could be sitting in the back corner of that choir stand. Nigga, you make it to that microphone just in time to start that solo. Am I lying? You know how a baby like this one. I love y'all to death. Y'all wrong because y'all be giving birth to your children, trying to hurry up and get back to work because you're excited. You want everybody to see the baby. Everybody gonna see that baby. Stay at home and give your body a chance to heal. Am I lying? It's a girl living behind my grandma. She four months pregnant. She done had the baby at four months out at the mall the next day with the baby on the hip, baby by that big. Baby head hanging. Baby got on Nike and FUBU. I said, is it a boy or a girl? She said, I don't know yet. <laughs> She's sitting in the middle of the mall, changing the baby pampers. It ain't even pampers or huggers. She using Topps reefer paper. She girl you better go on with that fetus that's some baby mamas that be at them drug dealer funerals y'all ain't up into one of them drug dealer funerals nigga they be putting stuff in the casket they got rims in there strippers and put their picture in the casket ass naked you forget to view the body be like damn look at sunshine I went to one drug dealer funeral they put so much stuff in the casket they had to take the body out in order to close it then he went to the cemetery and buried all that junk and left his ass up in the church. And see, I'm from Birmingham. We got a drive through funeral home. And you can't have no drive through funeral home for black people. We, are, we, we already take funerals hard as it is. You mean to get your damn self driving up, seeing your loved one in the window. You driving up. <laughs> <laughs> Not both your ass in the window. What if you go to the drive through funeral home, you and your boys, y'all been smoking weed all night, and you think you at rallies? You high as hell. You driving up, you know you. Fresh as our turn, baby. Get up, 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 get up,
Let me get a number three with cheese and no onions in our urns drink. Bitch, I know you hear me talking. <laughs> I'm gonna do this thing before I get out of here. Y'all having a good time? So hell yeah. If you came out of high school in the 70s, 80s, or 90s, make some noise. Can I do some old school before I get out of here? Take him back to seven. Come on, take him back. Take him back. Take, take him back. Take him back. Take him back. Uh 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 uh. I got I got one for you. Uh uh. Y'all yeah, wanna go back? Eighty five. Eighty five. Wild Wild West. Wild Wild West. Wild Wild West. Uh 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 uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Everybody do like this right here. If you don't do it, I'm gonna cut the lights on and start talking about folks. Everybody do like this right here. Do like this right here. There you go, do like this right here. Here you go, y'all ready? Here we go. Rock with me, just like this. Do it. My posse's on Broadway. Ah, you don't know nothing about that, that before your time. Y'all ready? On Follow me. Me and Kit Sensation at home away from home in the black Benz limo with a cellular phone. And I'm calling up the posse. It's time to get to ripping. I Freeze. need sunroof to keep you suckers coming. Everybody's looking. If you're jealous, turn around. Uh 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 uh. uh. Uh-uh. I need 10 people to stand up right now. I need some help right here. Can I get some help right here? Can I get a little help right here? Y'all ready? Let Everybody say, go ahead. Go. Y'all ready to do that, Pee Wee? Go ahead, dog. Let's go. Let's go. Uh-uh-uh-uh-uh. I got some. Uh uh uh. Gotta rip it. Uh uh uh. uh, uh here you go. Here you go. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, uh, uh uh uh. I'm gonna take it back. How many of y'all remember when Michael Jackson was a black man? Now he's a white woman. This is the last one. Y'all put your hands together. Put your hands together. Put your hands together. I'm finna get out the stage, boy. But this is my favorite damn video. Y'all want me to do the video for you? Can I do the video for you? Well, God dog will repeat other me. Let's go. The roof, the roof, the roof is on fire. Say what? He got a video. God bless y'all. Thank you. Y'all give it up to Ricky Smiley. Yeah, hold that. Hold that for me. Can you hold that? Ah, damn it, they're coming in now. All right. Give it up to him one more time, Ricky Smiley, y'all. That motherfucker was funny. Security? How was that? Security? 
What you doing? Going over your resume? What the fuck you mean? How did I get my... Put the camera on him. Put the camera on him. How in the fuck did I get my life like this? I'm not at the show. I'm in front of the motherfucking show. Sitting down, guarding some bullshit. My life's a fucking hell. I'm a loser, loser. I'm just fucking. I'm just fucking with you. That's a good job. Somebody gotta do that. Somebody gotta. What you? What the fuck you laughing at? What's? It's mighty funny when I'm fucking with him, ain't it? What you running around for, him, white man? There's a white man. Come here. Come here. All right, come here. We got black snipers. Come out. Bust. This ain't been white folks' year, man. This ain't. This ain't been that fucking year, man. It doesn't have been good. Goddamn sharks is fucking y'all up. Don't you? Don't y'all hear the goddamn music? Don't you hear the goddamn music? Don't you hear? When you hear that, get the fuck out of the water. When you hear that, could you play that again for them? Cause they don't. When you get out, get the fuck out. This shit happen to white people just don't happen to black people. You read the paper. Every week, somebody white fall in a hole. You can't even watch your soap operas because Becky done fell in the fucking hole. We don't rip our soap operas because Becky's in the fucking hole. Ain't this some bullshit? Ray Ray ain't going to fall in no goddamn hole. Ain't going to happen. But Ray Ray mama going to tell him, look at him. Let me tell you one goddamn time. There's a fucking hole out there in that front yard. Now you walk your bitch ass out there and fall in a goddamn hole. I'm not going to get your punk ass out. And that's it. That's all. I wish the fuck I would fall in the hole. My mom would come to the hole and whoop my ass out the fucking... I know goddamn well your bitch ass and in no fucking hole when I ask you good not to fall in the goddamn hole. How the fuck you think that made me look on my job when they call me and tell me your bitch ass is in a fucking hole? Now you get the fuck out the hole. Get the, get the fuck out that hole. White kids, man. Making bombs in the mama house, parents don't know nothing about it. Black people, raise your hand if you can make a bomb in your mama house and she don't know nothing about it. Ain't no motherfucking way. Shit, I couldn't even make a sandwich in my mama house when I... My goddamn mama used to count the light bread. One, two, three, four. I told you bitch ass before I left here not to make a motherfucking sandwich. And what the fuck you doing? You in here making goddamn sandwiches. Now you make another fucking sandwich in here. How the fuck you think that made me look on my job when they call me and tell you in here making sandwiches and falling in fucking hole? I want all that peanut butter off that fucking bread. I want it white like it was. Because the white kid lay a rule down. The rule is laid the fuck down. White child tell you don't go in his room. God damn it, don't go in his fucking room. This is my room. You and father are not to come in my fucking room. Stay out of my room. I hate you, I hate you. <laughs> Stay out your room, what kind of shit is that? Shit, you couldn't even close the door in my goddamn mama house. I know goddamn well you ain't sitting up here no motherfucking dolls clothes. You don't pay no fucking rent up in here. I want all the fucking dolls open. How the fuck you think that made me look on my job? And they call me and tell me you're in here closing dolls, making sandwiches, and falling in a goddamn hole. I'm retarded, I'm retarded. When I say F, you say, oh fuck, God, fuck. We can be here all night, it's up to y'all, God damn it. When I say F, you say, uh, 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 uh. Put your hands together for Atlanta's own. Give it up for my man, uh, wait. Come on.
Come on, show me some love, ATL. Niggas, ho, oh, show some love. Ah. Oh, shit, shit. Wait, say, oh, bitch, get out the way. Ah. You know, black people don't give a fuck if they don't know the name. They'll sing this motherfucking song like they wrote it. Take show, shout, shout. I said a shot, bitch. Shots and shit. Shot and shit, man, and my shot. Shit. Shot and shit, then a shot and shoot. Shot and shit, man, and man, and mud to do that. A hit, that a shot, shit. That a shit, and it. Oh, shit. God damn it, it's good to be home. God damn. Yeah, it is. God damn, the Hawks playing this motherfucker. Well, you know, the Hawks play like they don't even practice. Like they call each other. You know, we play this Sunday. You bullshitting. I need some tennis shoes, nigga. Give me a ride. Shit. I like Ludacris, because certain rappers, I love rap. Some of that shit is cool. Some rap I don't listen to because I get tired of them motherfuckers. Tired of buying that rap and hearing how good them niggas are living. I got Bentleys. I got a big house. Here I got this nigga CD, but I ain't got my rent. Something wrong with this fucking picture. That's why I download that nigga shit. You say you got cash money, nigga. Why you need my $18? Kiss my ass. Look at black people still late. Look at this shit. Black people are late by nature. There's some slaves still on their way over here. We are late. Some black people say Jesus is black. I don't know if that's true or not. But then again, that would explain why it's taking him so long to come back. Well, Jesus might be black, but I know who ain't black, Noah. I don't give a fuck what you say. Ain't no way black Noah family was black. Fuck you. Because ain't no way no black family was on no boat for 40 days and 40 nights and didn't eat them two chickens. <laughs> God would have been mad at them niggas. Didn't I tell you get two chickens? I'm not them chickens keepers, Lord. And then God said, well, you a pig short, too. It's good being like, see white people out here. I'm glad to see y'all out here hanging out because white people don't, woo, they'd have been through some shit. That September 11 shit had their ass shook. They ain't go out of nothing. You know, you know, the country in trouble when white people start speaking to your ass. They're like, how you doing? I will, how you doing? They're fucking like, how you doing? How you doing? Because you know some of them white people in old Buckhead be funky than a motherfucker. You try to speak to their ass, how you doing? <laughs> motherfucker, I said hi. But that September 11th shit had their ass shut. I got white friends. They like, ain't you afraid of terrorists? I'm like, fuck no, I'm a nigga. I've been living with terrorists all my life. I know a nigga that'll kill everybody in this motherfucker. Step on his brand new gators. Motherfucker, what? Some of you women, y'all living with terrorists. Come home late tonight. Bitch, where you been? Ow, Earl. Don't hit me in front of the children, shit. Y'all go in y'all room. Go in y'all room. That nigga is a terrorist. Some of y'all ain't laughing because the nigga here with you now. You hoping you don't set that nigga ass off and he whoop the shit out your ass. We black, nigga. I party with a terrorist every weekend. I'm gonna party with one tonight. I'm gonna be at the bounce. How you doing, baby? Pop out, bitch. They shooting again. Get behind here. Stay right here, bitch. Stay right here. That nigga is a terrorist. Only thing good about September 11, the only good shit. For the first time ever, black people ain't the suspect. I be loving that shit. I just be skipping by the police. How you doing? Oh, yeah, you looking for a sand nigga. Yeah, you looking for a nigga with a towel on his head. Because the FBI know niggas don't fuck with bombs. 
Cause you got to be on time with a bomb. A nigga fuck around, oversleep, boom, shut. God damn it. I knew I was supposed to do something this morning. Ain't this a bitch? Bitch, didn't I tell you wake my ass up? I supposed to been a terrorist this morning, shit. I done blew up my own basement, kissed my ass. Then they say they can't find Sodom Bin Laden. I'm upset with my white folks. How y'all let a motherfucker in a cave fuck up everything? They talking about they can't find a Sodom Bin Laden. They sending the wrong people to look for them. Don't send the Navy or the Air Force. Send child support. Oh yeah, child support to find his black ass. Say that nigga behind on his payments. He be in court by Monday. They found my black ass. My real name ain't Earthquake. They hunt my ass down. And you got to go to child support court. That's some funny shit. Oh, Lord, you got to go there early in the morning because you be seeing niggas going to child support court. They be thorough as shit. I ain't paying that bitch shit. She ain't getting nothing from me. She can kiss my ass. You see that nigga three hours later, I can't pay this shit. Come here, baby. Let me talk to your ass. Come on, shit. Hold up, Judge. Can we talk for a minute, shit? Come on, baby. You know I can't afford this shit. Nigga be working for for three weeks, get his check, it's $43. He go to his supervisor, who is this nigga Garner Smith? They show him a picture of his baby mama. And then they say, you know, Saddam Bin Laden is a coward. Yeah, that nigga's a coward, but something else that nigga is, that nigga's a hell of a motivated speaker. Cause ain't no way he can get me to kill my black ass and his ass stay in the cave. He had to tell me the plan like 15 times. I be in there like I'm retarded. Okay, one more time. I don't mean to fuck up the mission, but you got to tell me this. So I get the bomb, I get on the plane. Now how I get back here with you? See, that's the shit I don't understand. Rest of y'all niggas can leave, but we need to talk one more time. Okay, one more time. I get the bomb from him. I get on flight 788, now how I get back to tall boy? That's the shit I don't understand. Rest of y'all niggas can leave. We need to huddle up one more time. Call another play or something. And then I love that anthrax shit. Ooh, Lord, I wish they sent some more of that shit through the mail. I ain't paid a bill since. Sears called me, why you ain't paying your shit? My shit contaminated. Oh, Lord, I hope they send that shit through my mail. Because I forward all my mail to my baby mama. I've been trying to kill that bitch legally all my motherfucking life. I took that bitch to D.C. Here, pump some gas, bitch. Pump some gas. Go ahead, pump gas. God damn it, this nigga at Home Depot. Make up your mind. Come on, bitch. Put them groceries in there. Stay right there. Because it's true. And I love our motherfucking black people. We are real. If you don't understand that shit, I'm down with our ass. It's good. You got to give white people some credit, though. Because them motherfuckers, woo, I like working for white people. Because when you work for white people, you can call in. Them motherfuckers take excuses. I'm sick today. Stay home, nigga. Stay home. When you work for a nigga, ain't an excuse good enough. My father died. Mine did too, nigga. What time are you coming in? I let you go to the funeral, but you got to come in this Thursday. The nigga didn't love you anyway. That's why you had to get good jobs, nigga. Jobs is important. Best job I ever had was working in the cleaners. That was a good-ass job. I cried like a bitch when they fired me. They fired me for wearing other people's shit. I be at the club. Women like Earthquake always got something new on. I never see that nigga wearing the same thing. That's why you got to keep it real. Fuck that. Just had my son. I love it. I got to give it up for black women because they go through a lot of shit. I ain't understand. My wife was, yeah. Labor is some hard shit. My wife was in labor for 18 hours. I ain't know what to do. All you can do, man, is rub her back and give her some goddamn ice cubes and shit. But when you in labor with your wife, boy, when they having a baby, you got to be a strong man because they be testing your manhood. 
because her legs be up in the sternum and every two hours, it's a new doctor just putting his hand between her. Talking about, is you ready yet? <laughs> then another nigga come in, let me see if she ready yet. The third nigga came out like, hold up, this is my pussy. What we looking for? Because all y'all ain't going to stick your hands all up in this bitch. I got to take her home. And you big hand nigga, you better not come in this motherfucker no more. <laughs> it's the truth. And everybody got pets too. Fuck a pet. Time's too hard to have anything living in your house ain't pulling a fair share. Fuck fish and all that shit. I bought a pet I can use, an old retired police drug dog. So when I lose my last bag of herb, nigga, you better find it. Find your, feed your dog. Not till this nigga come home with an ounce. I be walking my dog through Decatur just finding nigga stash. <laughs> Good boy. Shit. You done found some cocaine. That's what I'm talking about, motherfucker. I go to my boy house. You got some herb? No, nah, nigga, I'm all out. <laughs> he say, yeah, you is. That nigga say, you got a blunt upstairs. You a selfish motherfucker. I used to do drugs, but shit, I seen Whitney Houston on TV, that bitch made me throw all my cocaine away. I don't give a fuck what you say, you're supposed to be losing weight around your knees and shit. What kind of drugs make that bitch kneecaps disappear? i like, this bitch ain't got no knees. What does she smoke and make her knees disappear? Whitney Houston's so skinny, when she be singing, you can see the words coming through that bitch's throat. The shit is like karaoke. I like, God damn. <laughs> it's the truth. That's why you got to keep that shit real. But white people got courage. I'm telling y'all, stay with them. I love white people because the motherfuckers got courage. I knew they had courage when I was in Pennsylvania. Nine miners. Motherfuckers were 350 goddamn feet below the ground. All nine of them co-workers stayed in there for four days and they finally found them and they dropped a cord down there and pulled their ass up and they all came up one at a time. That's when I knew it wasn't no niggas down there. Cause believe me, we would all came up at the same time. Nah, motherfucker, come on, uh-uh. They have been pulling, come on, nigga. Mm -mm, mm -mm. That's why black people, we gotta do something about our kids. Them little motherfuckers are dangerous. I don't know what's wrong with our kids. They are. They get on my fucking nerves. I took my daughter to the zoo, and niggas were shooting at the zoo. I went back three weeks later. Now the animals are racial profiling. A lion won't even come out of his cage if he see a nigga at it. He'll go like this. No, nah, fuck you. Rrr. Dangerous bastards. Little 12-year-old brother killed everybody in Burger King. When he got locked up, he gonna lie to the judge, talking about he innocent because he had a split personality. If I was a judge, I'd say, well, both of you niggas gonna do the time because one of y'all could have called the police. It only take one hand to dial 911, you bad bastards. That's why I'm scared of our kids. When I see four, five young brothers walking down the street, I'm like white people, oh shit, hit them niggas, come. Don't look at them, baby, don't look at them niggas. Fuck your hair, take that gold off. They'll rape both of us. What kind of nigga rape you and your wife? That ain't right. She like, help me, bitch, my ass hurt too. You need to help me, show them a titty, get them off of my motherfucking ass. I thought I had to fight these niggas. I didn't know they was a gang of rapists. You and your wife in rape counseling. They asked what happened, that bitch just started snitching. Well, they fucked him first. And he was screaming like a bitch. I was ashamed to be that nigga's wife. I'm like, why are you sitting and pissing all on yourself? You always trying to fuck me in the ass. I thought you said this shit didn't hurt, nigga. Oh, I'm gonna tell you like you tell me at night. Relax your muscles. Breathe slowly. He just wanna put the head in for a little while. Love y'all ATL earthquake and this motherfucker.
That's how it's done, baby. I know what you motherfuckers saying. Where can I get one of those? Well, we're going to take a pause for the cars. We're going to have an intermission. Y'all see the baby shoe? See the baby shoe on the end? See the baby shoe? Pick up the baby shoe. Get the baby shoe. Get the baby shoe. Get the baby shoe. See the baby shoe? That's for kicking ass. I can't kick ass in my regular shoes. We're going to have an intermission for about an hour and a half. Intermission be uh, three hours and 60 minutes. You can go home, check on your kids. Go home, flip your meat over, whatever you're doing, turn your greens down, whatever. We're going to have an intermission for six hours. And then we'll be right back here next Thursday to finish the goddamn show. So uh, go on out there and pee, ladies. It's a long line. Stand in line with your panties down so we can move the line real fast, okay? Have them down in line. So uh, go on back out there. Intermission be uh, 10 hours and we'll be right back here about 10 hours after 10 hours. Let's go. Get the fuck out. Let's go. Go. 12 hour intermission. All right. 34 hours. We'll be right back in. 72 hours. 180 hours. We'll be right back in. All right. Let's go. All right. Go. the stage, your host, J. Anthony Brown. All right. All right. All right. All right. How you doing there? This is just so goddamn disrespectful. Put your finger up when you walk past the fucking show, you know. Put your finger up. Everybody, there you go. All right. Everybody back. What's up, player? Pick him up in the red right there. Player coming down here. All right. Got your little snack. I ain't got nothing to eat at the house. Fuck, I'm hungry. Y'all kiss my ass. I'm hungry, motherfucking shit. I don't give a fuck. Are you, are you watching what I'm doing? Are you? Are we on the same fucking show? Right here, put the camera on here. Right there. Go ahead, enjoy yourself. Eat up. Go on, eat up. Man, brother, here, just fuck it. He just wore a t-shirt. Fuck it, he ain't. Look at this. What what color scheme is happening here? I don't know what. What's up, player? You all right? You look worried. Look like you're worried about the rent. Everything all right? Brother? With them tickets set your ass back or something? What the fuck? How about you? Right there. You. you. Are you watching me when I, when I point to fucking people? I ain't had my medication, goddammit. This guy here. That's why you got to work with white people. I'm telling you, it's, it's just hard to get my... Players, let me give you some information. Everybody back in their seat? Everybody? Somebody, everybody back? Fuck them. Fuck them. That's it. Well, just let this motherfucker out. That fuck their ass up when 
We all leaving when they come in. Are you having a good time, sir? Sir, security guard. Security? You know you haven't done a goddamn thing. People walking up here, she could have been the anthrax killer or some shit. When people, hey, I'm talking to you, you, Mr. Mister, Mr. Security, Mr. Security. When these, when these, turn around and look at me. These fucking people come up here, you don't, let these, this is our area. Hey. When some, hey. When somebody come up here, you pick up that chair and you hit them in the fucking head or something, all right? All right? Or cut them or some shit, I don't know. Players, let me give y'all some advice. The way to the lady's heart, how to impress your woman, let me tell you. Get this out. What are the young players at? Young players, raise your hand. Young ass players. Young. Okay. Old players, raise your hand. All right, if you sit next to an old player, raise your hand. If he don't want to acknowledge being an old ass fucking player. I ain't no old motherfucking player. I'm a... <laughs> what you do, here's how you impress your woman. What you do, players? Wake your lady up about 4 o'clock in the morning. And say, baby, you want to go to Walmart? I got to sneak it out there. Now, they will jump smooth the fuck up. Ranch off. Don't act like y'all don't know what the fuck ranching off is, don't. Let's not get cute in this motherfucker. Do I need to explain what the fuck ranching off is? Some of y'all ranched off tonight. Don't try to get cute in this bitch. That's when you go to the sink, you soap up the rag, huh? Are you with me, huh? You hit the hot spots. Bam, 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 bam. Do I need to go over that shit again? You go to the sink, soap up the rag, hit the hot spots. Bam, 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 bam. Put back on the same shit you had early in the daytime. Now, came, Walmart is my store. Walmart is my fucking store, but Walmart is doing some shit. I don't know how to explain this because I don't want to make nobody mad, nothing like that, but. Walmart, how can I say this? They're high in the handicap. They're high in the handicap. And don't get me wrong, the handicap need to work. They really do. But it's just a lot of shit that the handicap can't do. There's a lot of shit the handicap don't give a fuck about. Like bagging groceries. They can give a fuck about your groceries. They don't give a shit. And they'll put your bread in the bag and drop a ham on that motherfucker. You get home, you got dumplings in the goddamn bag. Because the handicap. Now, what the handicap do real well, and I don't want to offend nobody with it, but what they really do real well is the excellent greeters. They will greet the fuck out of you. You put a handicapped person in that greeting position, and you're going to get a greeting. I mean, good evening, welcome to Walmart. 